Good morning. It's so nice to see all of you this morning, and I know you're not here, but I know you're out there. And today, of course, is our Memorial Day Sunday, but tomorrow is Memorial Day. So, how many of you even know what the word memorial means? We celebrate it by going to visit cemeteries or loved ones. We also have picnics and parties and things of that nature. But Memorial Day was meant to give thanks to those who served our country and also to remember all those who have passed ahead of us. Now, you can remember, if you, some of you, that we used to go to the cemetery and if you look right behind me, we have a geranium and we would plant those at the grave sites of the ministers who have served this church. And since we would go to Old Plains and we would go to Wheeler, um, it was a time for us to remember them and to respect what they had done. We are not doing that this Sunday, uh, but I'm going to suggest to you that maybe this is something you can do with your family tomorrow. There are places in town where you might go to a cemetery and know someone who's there. You could pay respects. You could put a flower or maybe a flag so that people know that you were there and you had the opportunity to be part of the fellowship of Christ and to be a family celebrating all those who have come ahead of us. Now, today is also Ascension Sunday. That's a big word. I wonder how many of you even know what it is. To ascend is to go up. And when we remember we've been talking about Jesus for the last four weeks, where he was crucified and he rose again from the dead. They saw him on the way to Emmaus. He also visited them in the, a room where Doubting Thomas was able to figure out that he was who he said he was. And he was there for a while visiting with them, giving them all the information that he could about God and all that we were, they were going to be expected to do. And then he took them out into a field and he said, I want you to continue on. You're going to find out many things, and I think we do every day here. Things about how it is to treat other people and how you would carry on God's word and, of course, Christ's word. So, he took them out into a field, and this was the end. This is the time when we no longer saw Jesus. We feel him. We know what he did, but we don't see him anymore because he ascended. And guess what? Miss Kay has decided we are going to ascend. Now, the opportunity at some point to come visit the church and take a look. We'll see how many weeks it is that that will remain up there. But let us be a memory of the ascension, and I'm sure it's never been explained that way. Shall we bow our heads? Dear God, you have given us all we need to know through your son. We have felt your spirit. We know what it's like to have your comfort we ask that you be with us. You help us to remember those who have gone before us, to thank all military, all doctors, nurses, everyone who's helping right now. And we ask that you help us to make it a meaningful Memorial Day. In your name we pray. Amen. <laughs> 